What's up guys, welcome back to Road to Dark Matter series. In today's video, we'll be doing the LC-10. It is our last gun in the entire game that we don't have gold. It's a new SMG that was added here in Season 2. So this will be our last in the series for a little bit until they add new guns. But don't worry, we'll still be playing multiplayer. We'll be continuing with our challenge series where you guys submit your classes for what guns we have to do. And we already have one picked out for the next video, which will be a no scope only M82 build. So be on the lookout for that. And yeah, let's get right into the LC-10. Really quick, this is my camo prop. Progress I have on the LC10. Spray is done. Stripes is done. Classics done. Geometrics done. Flora is done. Science, we still need about 20 point blanks. And psychedelics done. So we literally only need point blanks. And then we have every gun in the game gold. Here are my attachments for the LC10. For my optic, I had the axial arms on because I was doing some long shots and hardcore, but we're gonna go ahead and switch this. I think we'll put on the snap point. Yeah, we'll, we'll do the snap point. We have the agency suppressor, task force barrel, SWAT, five milliwatt laser, field agent grip, 42 round speed mag, airborne elastic wrap, and no stock. Currently, I'm using the Gunfighter Wild Card. So if you're using any kind of other wild card and you can't have this many attachments, I recommend taking out the body, the stock, and maybe the muzzle. I don't know. It's all up to preference. I think this gun's really good. Uh, I've been having a lot of good games with it. It seems to work well in both core and hardcore, just like the Pharah. Uh, it seems like they added some good weapons in the Season 2 update besides the machete. And even that, the machete is not that awful. I just think it's the worst melee weapon they have. Anyways, this is my class. Stim, Tomahawk, Field Mic, Tack Mask, Scavenger and ninja with of course the gunfighter wild card also one more thing don't be surprised if i get a haircut sometime soon i haven't gotten cut in like a year and this is and this is getting way too long j money hey j money hey what's up dude hey i'm subscribed to you bro we'll talk let's go you want to say anything to the video yeah this guy is help like and subscribe fuck yeah, yeah. fuck yeah let's go all right love you i gotta do commentary so thank you thanks for watching nice guys Anyways, uh, earlier today, we went and played, uh, or I streamed some Outbreak. And Outbreak's really fun. There's actually so much, like, to do in that, in that mode. Like, it's, it's, it's really good. If you haven't played Outbreak, if you're not, like, a big Zombies fan or something, I'd say just try it out. Uh, I will warn you, it does take up, like, your whole day. So we streamed it for a few hours over on my Twitch channel, twitch.tv slash jmon3y26. I only I already messed up my own name. It was a good time. I really like it. It seems like it's... I thought it would be good for camos, but I went and I checked my gun uh, after I was done streaming, and it did, I didn't actually have too much done. Like, it's really good for elites. I feel like elites aren't even a problem at this point, but... Maybe I just need to get better at like looking for like what to do with camos and stuff. I didn't I didn't really get too much done. But like I was saying earlier, I really I like this gun a lot. I feel like it's really good. I'm curious to see how it does in Warzone. I've only used it one time in Warzone and it did, you know, pretty decently, but it was just like the ground loot one. I wonder how a cracked out build for it would do. Normally what I would be doing right now is uh the gung ho thing where I'm holding like a stun or a smoke in my other hand and I'm rushing right up on people to get those point blanks. But I don't know if it was the season two update or a little before, but they've they've fixed point blanks. Point blanks are a lot easier to get. You you only have to be like uh like a, a few feet away from them instead of like giving them a catheter. So hopefully it doesn't take too long to get these point blanks so I can go ahead and like edit this video and crank it out for you guys. There we go. That's two point blanks right there. Let's go. Give me that point blank. Going back to the outbreak thing. I really like how much they've, they've really added to zombies. There's so much depth into it now. There's all these like skills and everything you can upgrade. Field upgrades you can upgrade. You know, guns, ammo mods, pack a punching and everything. There's just so much to do in it. It's like a lot of information to take in. So I we will probably get the hang of it. You know, the more we do it, but Outbreak was just a blast, especially playing it with friends. So let me know if you guys are interested in this. I have some Warzone stuff recorded. Uh, we're not too crazy at it, but I think the, the gameplay is funny of uh, Sam and I playing so some Warzone. So let me know if you want to see that. And also let me know if you want to see like solo gameplay and stuff of me trying out different classes. Like maybe I try both like the season two weapons or I try to use like my melee weapons or something in Warzone. Like if you want to see Warzone content, I know it's kind of oversaturated. Every, you know, COD YouTuber plays almost strictly war zone so i i you know i understand if like oh another one's doing it it's not like it'll become my only form of content but i you know i think it, it might be nice to throw it in there and spice it up also things like search and destroy or if we get gold on every gun in the game like we we finally can like 
the whole game opens up for us. There's so much to do. I've also seen suggestions of people saying like, I should go for all the dark ops challenges. And I think that's a good idea too. I'm not going to sit here and play and be like, oh, I unlocked the dark ops challenge. I didn't know what I was going for. I'm going to Google them. I, I will Google them. I do not care. And since we're going to be starting our road to dark aether, we got to start on a certain like, you know, weapon class of what we're going to get next. And I think shotguns are probably the easiest introduction. I feel like that's the easiest thing you can get like completion camos on is plague diamond shotguns they're so cheese i think i already almost have them gold so it should be pretty easy but my only issue with uh you know making zombies content is how long it takes to play a game of zombies like it'll probably take you know outbreak took us a few hours and we x filled at like difficulty level five i mean we're, we're kind of dicking around a little bit but it was like it was nothing too crazy like we didn't get too far what's the most optimal round to x fill at i've heard it's like 36 Again, if you guys could tell me what ammo mods you can and can't use that count towards camos. When we were playing Outbreak, I didn't use a single ammo mod. I didn't want to risk it. And we still didn't get, you know, too much done. So again, if you guys are zombies experts, you know, leave leave your tips in the comments. It'd be greatly appreciated. This is basically the first zombies I've really gotten into. I played it a little bit in like original Black Ops, but I never got like too deep into it i would just casually play it with friends and the only time we really got far was when you could get where there's a glitch where you can get on the table on five that's a point blank we hardly got any of that game well i guess we still needed 20. how many did we get in that game though 11. i guess that's not too bad just keep those numbers up and since this uh series is kind of going on a hiatus until new guns get added uh i just want to thank you guys for all the support you've been giving the channel and just the you know this series in general I never expected, uh, you know, just videos of me playing the game would start doing well. I was just mainly making guides at, you know, the point where it was taking too long for me to put them out in time. It would be like a week or maybe two in between of like me uploading. So I was like, okay, let's just start making videos of me getting the camos. And then, you know, it's, it started doing really well. Like you guys like those videos. So I really, I appreciate the hell out of that. You know, it's, it's like every kid's dream to uh, be able to make YouTube videos like and make like a series that people want to watch. Like it's it's pretty crazy. Like when I started this channel, you know, I created this channel in 2014. I was making all kinds of different videos, mostly like Counter-Strike and all that. I never would expect it to get to this point. So th thank you again. It's actually insane that I'm even at this point. And even more insane is we're almost at 69,000 subs. Like we're, we're, at the time I'm recording this, we're only 200 away from a funny number. And just last year around this time, I think I was at 69, not even like thousand or anything, just straight up 69. So the amount of growth this channel's gotten and like all the love you guys have been giving, like the videos, the series, just everything. Like I, I can't, I can't thank you guys enough. It's just really cool to see something you know, I, I put a lot of time and, and work into grow. With that being said, in this series coming to a hiatus, uh, guides will be coming back. Probably not as soon as I would like them to, because they do take a little bit of time to make, and I haven't made one in a while. So, you know, I got to get my feet wet, you know, get back into making the, that type of content. But in the meantime, I'll still have like a multiplayer video for you guys. Uh, I'm going to try to sprinkle in different kinds of videos uh, throughout the week. I've been trying to upload as, as much as I can. Like, we were uploading daily for a little bit there, like, uh, last week. That was a fucking grind, I'll tell ya. Now, I'm trying to get as consistent as possible, so adding in these new series can help. But I'm gonna try to get a schedule in place. Uh, I'm still working around, like, my actual job. And balancing that with, like, YouTube and just my actual life. So, you know, there's, there's a lot of balances that come with this. It's a lot of work, but I, I'm busting my ass. I'm trying to get as much out for you guys as possible. So if there's like a day I don't upload or something, or like it, it's been a little bit, or you're not seeing like as much consistency, like as you may have come to expect, uh, I'm trying. Just know that I'm not going to quit on this anytime soon. Uh, I'm going to be busting my ass to try to get as much out for you guys as possible. You know, the best way to keep up with any of that is, you know, it's really easy to just put updates on Twitter. So you don't got to follow it. But if you're wondering like, oh, why hasn't he uploaded today or something? Just check on there. I'll probably tweet out. Like the other day I had an issue while I was editing. Some of my audio got messed up or whatever. So I had to upload the video pretty late at night. That was my last upload. I uploaded it at like 8 p.m. when I usually upload like early as hell in the morning. 
So like if you're just wondering where a video's at, when it's coming out, maybe what even video I'm doing, usually you can find out on Twitter. Uh, I'll have that linked in the description. And I'll also tweet out when I'm streaming and all that. If you don't want to miss a stream, I do stream at weird times. It's usually either in the afternoon or in the middle of the night. So if you're interested in any of that, all the links will be in the description. That's a point blank. There's going to be guys upstairs that are begging to be a point blank kill. There we go. Oh, I should have tossed the tomahawk. Oh, Semtexes do so much damage. That's like Semtex and tomahawks, I think, are the top two equipment that you can have. I might be a little biased, but you, you, you can't deny the speed and just lethality of a tomahawk if you're accurate with it. Don't you fucking shoot me. See, that was a point blank. I was nowhere near him. Oh, I should have switched to the machete. We get a few point blanks there. We just got to get into their building and then it's easy. I'm actually so glad that they... Oh, shit. I had to go into gamer mode there. I'm so glad that they upped the range for point blanks because it was ridiculous before. You literally had to touch them with your gun. But now it feels pretty doable. Like, you can get done a lot faster. All right, we only have... Let's see. We got three more point blanks to go, and then every game is done. So let's just finish this off on face off. All right, let's get a point blank right here. Nope. It was awful. Let me get a let me get a point blank. Somebody let me get a point blank. That's one. Don't turn around. That's it. What? That's two point blanks. Did we just get scammed? Okay, guess I'll have to get more. That better be it. There it is. An embarrassing fashion. But we finally have every gun in the game gold. Every point blank's done. Every kill behind cover. Every backstab. Every, you know, name a challenge. We've done it all. It's actually crazy. I spent way too much time playing this game. But I would have it no other way. Let's end this game on a high note. This is actually probably the worst map to snipe on. There we go. There we go. Oh! No, if that Tomahawk hit, dude. All right, let's see what the mastery camos look like for this gun. Gold, pretty decent. Diamond's really nice. And Dark Matter's pretty good, too. All right, this is what it looks like in-game with Dark Matter. It actually looks really good. There's a lot of coverage on this. They're they're learning. They, they, did, they did the coverage right on this. That looks so nice. That's every gun. We have every gun in the game done. Now, we have every single gun in the game. Every weapon. In multiplayer, gold. We've completed everything. I guess that's it for me today. The series is going on a hiatus uh, until they add new guns, but we still will be playing multiplayer. We'll be mixing in some zombies, some Warzone, you know, as, as much as we can do. But if you like the video, like it. If you didn't dislike, uh, if you're new here, hit that sub button. We're literally just a few hundred away from 69,000. I'll see you guys next time. Later.